Hello everyone and welcome back to another episode of Let's Play Evil Genius. So when last we left off, we had just concluded our meeting down here with the other crime lords. We shrank one of them, uh, the guy from England, I believe. Or maybe we atomized him, I don't know, but it looked like we shrank him. So I'm pretty sure that's what we actually did. Uh, so the next objective that popped up is that we need to do better living through chemistry. So we need to steal parts for and build a research program. And it recommends, well actually let me go ahead and read the objective for you. So it says, build a laboratory and start a research program. You'll need a research machine to analyze samples, a database to store relevant information, and at least one piece of research apparatus with which to perform the actual experiments. A technology, a technology exhibition, I don't know why I couldn't read that, is currently underway in Japan. It might be a good idea to attend. So if we go to the world domination screen, we go to Japan, we have this. The Oriental Investigation. Our technicians have received word that a brand new research machine is in development. This equipment would let us develop new technologies. The scientists who came up with the machine are showing it off at the brilliant Boffins Bazaar, or B3. <laughs> B3. Cute. In Tokyo next week. Uh, this is an excellent opportunity to steal the machine and kickstart the evil research program. So it has a risk of one, so you're almost guaranteed to do it. Uh, really high heat, uh, five notoriety, the same as most other acts of infamy, and five minutes and twenty seconds to actually do. So, we're going to want to go ahead and load up on techs. Um, we'll go ahead and send five. Well, actually, we'll just go ahead and do five of each like we normally do. So, 15 guys. Um, not a huge drain on our resources, but, you know, whatever. Um, we're not going to lower the heat that much, unfortunately, but hopefully we should cut that time in half. Two, actually. Man. Chatty Cathy up in my radio. Anyway, um, but yeah, I mean, that's really all I'm going to do. I'm going to kind of keep my, I would like to increase my notoriety, but I kind of want to, seriously, lady, I am talking. I, I, I kind of want to keep my notoriety around where it's at. Uh, there's really no need to grind at this point, uh, mostly because I want to avoid getting any super agents on my island for as long as possible. Um... Mostly because super agents are just a huge, huge pain in the ass, and they're unkillable. So they're very much like your henchmen, only they can actually kill your henchmen. Oh, that's something I should actually talk about. Let me see if I can't find Lord Kane. All right. So something you may notice is up here it says lives, and there are three of them. So your henchmen cannot be killed by regular agents or by getting knocked unconscious on the world domination map. Uh, they can, however, be killed by super agents. Um, think James Bond. And they only have three lives. And once a super agent drops them three times, they're dead and gone forever. So you kind of want to make sure that that doesn't happen. And the way I normally play is, like... Well, really, I mean, without spoiling anything, there's really only two islands. This is our staging island to really get, oursel to get ourselves known in the world. And then the volcano island that we showed off underneath our desk, that's the last island, or the second island. And, yeah, so, I mean, it's possible to kill the super agents, but you have to do it in a very, very specific way, and you can't do it until island number two. So, like I said, I just kind of like to avoid that. Uh, but in the meantime... See how, okay, yeah, so we did manage to cut this in half. So I'm going to go ahead and do this mission. Um, and then once we have it, uh, I'm probably going to go ahead and cut the video for now. Just because, I mean, I don't really have too much else to talk about, I don't think. It's going to take up two minutes. Um, so like I said, I'll go ahead and cut the video. Uh, I'll come back right before that mission finishes. Or if it fails, you know. And we will continue on with the plot. So see you guys in two minutes. Alright everyone, so welcome back. So as you can see, this is just about to pop. We're in the last couple of seconds. And... Got it. Konnichiwa. Welcome to the evening broadcast of the Nippony National Wireless Service. Tonight's headline continues to be the theft of the prototype research machine from the B3 event in Tokyo. This machine has potential to be very dangerous if it is to be used for evil purposes. And all five global defense alliances have vowed not to rest until they have tracked down the culprits and brought them to justice. Alright, um, so as you can see right there, it says new henchmen are available to join your cause. Check out the world map for their locations. So that would be... Um, the Matron, who I definitely want to try to pick up. 
Uh, Dr. Neuroside, which, she's okay. Uh, that's something else. That's something else. Oh, and Red Ivan, who I will never, ever get. Because he is more of a pain in the ass. And so Red Ivan's kind of funny. Because, as you, as, as you can see right here, so it says, and I'll just read it. Uh, our spies have found the hideout of the villainous former secret police general, known simply as Red Ivan. He carries a bazooka and is deliciously sadistic with it. Armed to the teeth and built like the proverbial brick latrine, <laughs> uh, it would certainly pay dividends to have him on our side in a fight. And that is true, he is, he's a really strong, but like it says, he also uses a bazooka, and he's very indiscriminate with it. So he'll use that thing anywhere, in your base, outside, uh, it does friendly fire, it blows up all your own equipment, so he's kind of a pain. Um, I guess he's funny to use, but... I mean, he's not really worth it, because you end up losing more minions and taking more damage than he actually does good. So, is this shenanigans? Right, so we need a, la we need a laboratory. That is an infirmary. It is the Alright, so we're going to go ahead and put the door to the laboratory right here. And it doesn't need to be too big to start with, but it does end up getting to be pretty good size. So as you can see, the regular research machine is a hundred thousand, and that's all of our monies, all of it. But whatever, Object has been ordered. it's worth it. So we're gonna need to do some more stealing. Um, we did the active infamy in Patriot, so they're on high alert. Uh, let's go ahead and steal from the Middle East. Yeah, that should be good. Uh, we're also going to pick up the Matron. Warning! Hostile presence detected in base. No, don't leave that briefcase full of money. Why are there two briefcases full of money? Don't just leave those. Uh, the other thing we're going to want to do... Uh, it hasn't told us to do it yet, but... Well, let's go ahead and check it out. So, so we stole the research machine, uh, and the forces of justice are going to want it back. Um, yeah, okay, so here are the things. So we need... Uh, the laboratory needs at least one piece of experimental apparatus before you can start ordering experiments. We have to steal either the centrifuge, the impact stress analyzer, or the laser. Then research some new stuff. The forces of justice are going to be a constant thorn on our side until they've retrieved the research machine, build a fake, and then trip the, trick them into stealing that. So what I like to do is I like to just build a little tiny research room right out here. And then we will build the fake research machine right inside of it. Uh, we are also... I'm going to go ahead and stick some valets here, because for this one, fool the press. The alliances know about the research machine theft, and they won't rest until they've stolen it back. A cunning, a cunning duplicate will fool them into thinking that they've stolen the real thing. Make sure that the alliances know who was responsible for the theft by breaking into the London Messenger's print works and changing the headlines. This should ensure that a lot of retrieval experts are dispatched to the island to steal the fake research machine. So we'll do that, too. So mostly it's just going to mean that there's going to be more agents on our island until we can get them to steal the fake research machine back. Which shouldn't be too big of a deal. Although we're going to take a huge hit in our money because... Which is weird because even though we just stole the fake research machine, you think we'd get it for free. But we still have to pay for it, which is bizarre. Um, also, there should be some new types of minions on the map that we can pick up. There's definitely some new acts of infamy we can do. I think, because didn't we pick up... Yeah, we picked up the chalkboard. And the mouse maze. Yeah, because the chalkboard here... Uh, it's the next level up for... So, like, level one of the science minions is technician, level two is scientists, and then it splits off into biochemist and quantum physicist.
are not guys up here yet? Yeah, they totally are. All right, let's go ahead and grab the major. Yeah, no funds are loaded. I cannot afford the research machine. Oh, I totally can. We spent all our money just making the research room. Oh, look, here's some thieves. So this is the one time that I don't kill Patriot burglars. The headline tonight, Psychopathic Old Woman on the Loose. Last year, Europe was gripped by the trial of the matron, an elderly Swiss woman who was eventually convicted for the torture and murder of countless patients in her care. Yeah, Earlier crazy. today, the matron escaped from her prison with the help of some unidentified minions. Some unidentified minions. Oh no. So these guys are gonna go ahead and steal until their valets get here so we can do that fool the press. Don't leave that money just sitting there. Someone pick that up. Some investigators, some boiglers. Boyglas. Man, we lost a lot of money. I don't need to get that back. Seriously, someone pick up that money. Don't just leave that there. You better be picking that money up. Thank you. Damn. If they just leave that money out, the burglars will just pick it up and run away with it. It's a teensy bit frustrating. Someone getting this? He's getting this. I kind of want those valets to show up before... So I can actually do that act of infamy. Because otherwise these guys are just going to steal it. So this is kind of funny. You see how that's moving? It's all sewn together. It's just a big balloon. I don't know how anyone could possibly think that's a fucking research machine. It's a giant balloon, but, you know, whatever. Oh, there we go. Commencing mission. Go ahead and get that taken care of. Alright, so I'm probably going to have to do some more money grinding off camera um, so that we can actually afford the research machine that we stole. But... You guys need to leave. Or, where's the matron? Is she here yet? Yes, yeah, she is. Tiger okay, moved. Tiger moved. Get down here. Yeah, the matron's pretty funny. Um, where is she? So let's go ahead and go. Alright. So the matron used to be a well disposed. Right? Well disposed? Yeah. Uh, old dear called Elsa Crab. Elsa worked at the Swiss Mental, in Mental Institute, working to restore the sanity of her patients and comfort those that were beyond her talents. That was until an unfortunate mix-up at the pharmacy. Instead of her usual sedative, Elsa swallowed some experimental psychosis drugs. The effect on her personality was quite shocking, to say the least. She took to calling herself the Matron, and quickly instituted a harsh regimen of ritual humiliation and prolonged electroshock therapy. You notice she's missing a hand. Uh, the matron lost her right hand. Oh, I just pointed that out. The matron lost her right hand after a vicious bite from a patient. Wow. What? Were you treating like an alligator? How? Anyway. But even this proved to be a blessing. Gone was her arthritis-riddled hand, and in its place, a state-of-the-art prosthetic that could operate the electroshock machines in a ceaseless parade of agony and torture. Her sadistic methods were only uncovered when the Swiss Electricity Board decided to instigate why, just why a small village in the mountains was consuming more power than Zurich. <laughs> so she has two abilities, motherly love, which isn't bad. In the recent theft of the Japanese research machine, the London Messenger newspaper reports that a notorious evil organization has claimed responsibility for the theft, promoting widespread concern for the global defense agencies who have all vowed to retrieve the technology. In other news, the London Messenger print works were raided last night, but nothing of value was taken. Alright, so that was a little it's weird. It's for the own good! Um, my game kind of cut off while I was reading, or something happened to the screen and I you couldn't see anything while I was reading cruel. the Matrix description, and then when I was trying to fix it, a bunch of other stuff happened and, you know, so now we're back here. So give me just a second. Let's get back to this. Alright. So, 
as I was reading before the game decided to interrupt me, Motherly Love is the matron... The matron's caring side shows through with her ability to target another henchman to temporarily increase the recharge rate of their special abilities. So this one is fairly useful because it allows you to, like, you can have one henchman use their abilities and then have the matron use motherly love to recharge it really fast. Uh, electroshock treatment. Uh, the matron can administer her own brand of therapy to enemies using a hand attachment draining their smarts. This one is actually really handy. Now, I don't remember if they fixed it with the patch that I have installed. Uh, they might have, and I could be doing it wrong. But it used to be that you could actually use electroshock therapy to bug out the super agents. Like, if you had the matron use electroshock therapy, whoever you used it on would just stand there and wait for the matron to get to them. So they'd stop attacking other, they'd stop attacking your your minions and your other henchmen, and it'd be really, really handy, because they'd just stand there and get punched in the face uh, until the matron got there and then electrocuted them. So, we'll see if that still works, but that's what I'm going to be trying to get her up to first. Spare the rubbish. Is electroshock therapy. Because even though motherly love is useful, electroshock therapy is better. Alright. Yay, they're stealing the research machine, air quotes. So these guys we don't want to kill. For obvious reasons. stealing. Yeah, we need to steal more than that. Where are those guys? No, don't come inside. Go away. He just kicked her. Did you see that? He dropped her on the floor and then kicked her. Alright, so as you can see, the matron has lost all of her, her health and her endurance. But she hasn't lost any of her lives. Because she was not knocked out by a super agent, she was knocked out by a regular agent. So yeah, I need these guys to leave the island. They need to go away. You also notice their health is all the way back up again, because once they drop them off in the barracks... Will you go away? Leave. Leave my island. I don't need you guys here mucking everything up. You need to leave. Okay. Don't steal money. No, if you steal money, I'm going to have to kill you. Warning. The object is being stolen by an intruder. You know, now you, you have to die. Alright. I want you to steal the fake research machine, not all my money. No, no, die. Go away. Alright, your behavior is unacceptable. You also notice that her, her missing hand Time for the medicine. is now a mace. It's like, a mace. Yeah, just keep right on. Taking that. No, don't. Goes out there. Man, it's like a pain. There, we got what little money we had back. You guys go away. Anyway, this is going to be a little bit frustrating. Okay, there's the fake research machine. Intruder type by psychological weakening. You go away. No one likes you, thieves. What I should have done was build this room a little bit deeper and then put like a level 3 door here because that would attract all their attention. But yeah. Um, so while I'm waiting for some jackass to steal that thing, uh, I'm going to go ahead and cut the video because this is going to take a little bit of hurting and plus we're just going to be flooded with, with burglars and things like that. And even after they steal it, after you saw, they're not just going to leave the island right away. 
they're actually going to get curious and try to explore until their time runs out, which we do not want. Warning. Detected in base. And plus, I need a money grind until we get up to another 100,000. So yeah, I will do that, and once we get one of those two goals accomplished, either the stealing of this or the purchasing of... Oh, we have it! Um... How? Oh, that's right. It doesn't go all at once. They take it little by little. So, there's that, I guess. That's how much I'm paying attention. You need to go off the island as well. All of you need to leave. Go over here, steal this thing, and then leave me alone. Ah, uh, because we still need one of these devices. Um... Let's go ahead and steal the laser, actually. So we need two techs and two guards. We'll go ahead and do four and four. Warning! Burglary in progress. It better be the... Intruder detected on security Are you leaving? Network. Shadowing targets. Don't shadow targets. Leave the island. Weakness Leave the island. Issued. Leave. Go away. Warning! Hostile presence detected in base. Too many guys going back and forth between this door. Uh, I should really move this door right here. Frustration. Matron, go get some experience. Kill this, this burglar. Is going to hurt them more than it'll hurt who I said kill her. <laughs> anyway, I'm just going to do this for a little bit. Hopefully... No! Why would you drop it? Don't... Uh, yeah, I'm going to do this for a little bit. Um... So I guess I can rage on camera, or off camera, whatever, but these burglars are really chafing me, really chafing me. Anyway, uh, I'm going to try to get this objective completed off camera so you guys don't have to just watch me scream like a little child, <laughs> which that may or may not be amusing for you, but it doesn't really make... I don't know. Anyway, uh, I'll be back. Oh, I guess I should read this, too. So it says... Boop. Mission underway. Well, it doesn't say boop. It says, The research machine is useless without items of experimental apparatus with which to perform experiments. Warning. The laser... It better be the fake machine. Is a relatively new invention that has has the potential to revolutionize the world of science, but simulating a research sample with burst, or by simulating a research sample with, with bursts from a high-intensity industrial laser. New research options can be pursued. Steal the experimental laser from the research lab, where it is currently being kept. As a risk of zero, heat of 20, notoriety of 5, and you saw the time. Are you, are you leaving? Don't take a closer look. Leave the island. Leave the island. Are you Smash? I think you're not your patriot. I don't know why I thought she was smashed in an eagle patriot. Just go away. Just get on the helicopter or something and leave my island with the machine. Air quotes. Pain. Anyway, I'm going to cut the video again until either she leaves or we get that apparatus. This thing. Which is only going to be about a minute either way. So, see you guys then. Alright, so she's actually returning to HQ, which, thank you. Well, I really wish you'd stop the... I'm a super sneaky burglar walk. That's kind of frustrating. Uh, how much further are we are on this thing? Almost done. Another 30 seconds. So, yeah. That was... annoying. Intruder type for psychological weakening. Plus, there's a higher percentage of agents on my island right now. Thank you. There's a higher percentage of agents on my island right now until these guys go away. The 
Pacific Radio. This is Pacific Freaking FM, amazing. and I'm Larry Driscoll, keeping you up to date with regional events from California all the way up to Alaska. The story on everyone's lips today is the big felony committed earlier. No one knows who's responsible yet, but everyone's got a theory. Isn't that right, Bill? Ha <laughs> ha, yeah. Even the penguins in Alaska got a theory, Larry. Penguins are from the South Pole, Bill. Damn it, Larry. Why do you always show me up on air? Got a new. All right. <clears throat> so better living here. Chemistry is done. Now we have the master plan machination. Uh, we'll need a master plan before we can build a doomsday device to take over the world. Reach a notoriety rank of two of insane two hundred. There are three embryonic ideas, embryonic ideas for doomsday devices, but each needs three pieces of vital information before it can be pursued any further. The inf information can be found in many ways. It could be hidden in a region on the world domination map, captured as a reward for completing an act of infamy, or held by an enemy agent invading your very base. And these ones are kind of so. There's three separate three sets of plans, um, and each piece is actually held in you know one of those ways, either through world do either through hidden on a region of world domination active infamy and by an enemy agent. So we start with one, but there are eight others. So it's not that bad. Uh, loot and pillage. Raise enough assets and in money and uber loot to open the doors and the corridors of power, and to purchase a new island if the need should arise, which is the second island we go on to. Steal four of the six pieces of uber loot strewn around the globe. Each alliance has at least one uber loot in its regions. Um, there should be some optional missions popping up sometime soon. Now, the way we can tell who has so this guy him and his cohorts have um, one of the things so we need to capture him uh, you only need one of them this guy has one so capture him we can kill his cohorts and we can go ahead and bring these guys back because they are in a dangerous position Oh, right, so this is the Spin Doctor, the Mercenary, there should be another one right here somewhere, there's another Spin Doctor, those guys are still stealing, and the Scientist, so we need to take capture all of those guys. There should be one more. Alright, so the rest of these guys need to die. Uh, so we'll actually go ahead and get kill, capture, get out of here, Lord Kane. Alright, um, so while they are doing that, I'm actually going to go ahead and check the time to see how far along we are, and I will be back in a jiffy. See you guys in a minute. Wow, I lost track of time. Um, so yeah, that's the end of this episode. Uh, when we come back, I will start picking up some doomsday device plans so thank you very much for watching and join me next time on let's play evil genius